Ta-da! Here it is. This is our final output of the tie-dye t-shirt. So we waited it for to dry and this is the final output. Hello guys! Today, in this video, I'm going to show you how to do a tie-dye um, t-shirt. This is only one method of it. This is the easiest one for me. So, let's get along with it. So, for the materials, so, um, we will be needing a plain shirt, mostly white, so you can clearly see the colors. We have rubber bands. We need rubber bands to tie the shirt. Also, um, we need to make acrylic paint. Three colors, I think, is the best. We just put acrylic paint and then water. And a pan for um, dropping the shirt here and pouring down the colors. <coughs> so, the method that we're going to do today is called the... Uh, um, Spiral roll tie dye. So for the procedure, you just go to the middle. Wait, wait. See here. Go here at the middle. You just spiral it. So you just spiral it. It's much basic. It's much basic. Then you just fix it using the rubber bands. So that it would it wouldn't extend. This is how it will look like. So you just um put the rubber bands like this or in any other way so the second step is, with the third step is you will put it here on the pan so it's optional then you're just going to pour it so now we're going to pour the red color it's just my first time doing this so just pour it carefully so it wouldn't Go to the pan, try to be gentle. I'm going to pour the rest. So you must be careful so that you wouldn't pour the whole thing. If you pour the whole thing, you couldn't restart it. The yellow's bright. Okay. Okay. Now I'm going to turn it upside down so we can um color also the ground part. Yeah, you also need to be careful so you don't affect the so you must do it gently okay um now I want to add the blue I think you should put lots of it so it would fully absorb the color if you put less i guess it will less absorb so, some parts that i that still fight so i guess it's okay now we are done coloring the whole 
cloth. Now we are just going to wait for the cloth to dry up. And we are going to see how it will look like. So this is our cloth for now. After we just colored it. So tada! Here it is! So this is my final outfit after drying it under the sun. So as you can see, the color is lively. The bright colors are dominant. So see how beautiful uh, it is from the colors, from the three colors that we only added, it became beautiful as this and lively. So I also made one for my brother. So now I'm going to try out um, what I tie dye. So here it is. This is how it will look like if you wore it. So I hope you enjoy and learn from my video today. And if you and, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to keep you posted on our upcoming videos. Thanks for watching.